The Song of the Mouth Organ by Robert Service, read for LibriVox.org by Heidi Preuss. With apologies to the singer of the Song of the Banjo. I'm a homely little bit of tin and bone. I'm beloved by legions of the lost. I haven't got a vox humana tone, and a dime or two will satisfy my cost. I don't attempt your highfalutin flights. I'm more or less uncertain on the key, but I'll tell you, boys, there's lots and lots of nights when you've taken mighty comfort out of me. I weigh an ounce or two, and I'm so small. You can pack me in the pocket of your vest, and when at night so wearily you crawl into your bunk and stretch your limbs to rest, you take me out and play me soft and low, the simple songs that trouble your heart-strings, the tunes you used to fancy long ago, before you made a rotten mess of things. Then a dreamy look will come into your eyes, and you break off in the middle of a note, and then, with just the dreariest of sighs, you drop me in the pocket of your coat. But somehow I've bucked you up a bit, and, as you turn around to face the wall, you don't feel quite so spineless and unfit. You're not so bad a fellow, after all. Do you recollect the bitter Arctic night, your camp beside the canyon on the trail, your tent a tiny square of orange light, the moon above consumptive-like and pale, your supper cooked, your little stove aglow, you tired, but snug and happy as a child, then twas turkey in the straw, till your lips were nearly raw, and you hurled your bold defiance at the wild. Do you recollect the flashing, lashing pain, the gulf of humid blackness overhead, the lightning making rapiers of the rain, the cattle horns like candles of the dead, you sitting on your bronco there alone, in your slicker, saddle sore and sick with cold? Do you think the silent herd did not hear the mockingbird? or relish silver threads among the gold? Do you recollect the wild Magellan coast, the headwinds and the icy roaring seas, the nights you thought that everything was lost, the days you toiled in water to your knees, the frozen ratlines shrieking in the gale, the hissing steeps and gulfs of livid foam? Then you cheered your messmates nine, with Ben Bolt and Clementine, and Dixieland and seeing Nelly home. Let the jammy banjo voice the younger son, who waits for his remittance to arrive. I represent the grimy, gritty one, who sweats his bones to keep himself alive, who's up against the real thing from his birth, whose heritage is hard and bitter toil. I voice the weary, smeary ones of earth, the helots of the sea and of the soil. I'm the Steinway of strange mischief and mischance. I'm the Stradivarius of blank defeat. In the down world when the devil leads the dance, I am simply and symbolically meat. I'm the irrepressive spirit of mankind. I'm the small boy playing knuckle-down with death. At the end of all things known, where God's rubbish heap is thrown, I shrill impudent triumph at a breath. I'm a humble little bit of tin and horn. I'm a byword, I'm a plaything, I'm a jest. The virtuoso looks on me with scorn. But there's times when I am better than the best. Ask the stoker and the sailor of the sea. Ask the mucker and the hewer of the pine. Ask the herder of the plain, ask the gleaner of the grain. There's a lowly, loving kingdom, and it's mine. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.